So hello everyone. Uh, it's been a while since I made a video. I apologize for that. I know a lot of people look forward to the different videos that I've made. And uh, so I'm sorry I haven't done one for quite some time. Anyway, I wanted to introduce uh, my new laser that I have. It's called the, it's uh, from a company called Aspen and it's called the Apex Laser. And so it has this head up here, which I'll show you in a second. And I'll take that off. Um, but this is a high power laser. I'm just gonna put in some glasses here. And I gotta remember everything I'm doing here is reversed. So when I'm over at the skeleton, I gotta try to remember that right, left stuff and because everything is reversed here. But this is the head where the laser energy comes out of. And there's actually four wavelengths that come out of this uh, head. And I'm just gonna put it into kind of a standby mode and you'll see this little red laser. You can see that on my neck here. And the red laser is just an indicator light. It's uh, five milliwatts. Uh, just to tell you that this, the machine is active and it's ready to be turned on. And there's a little button here I'm just going to press. And what you'll see is you'll see all this extra light. Now the camera is kind of interesting. So what this laser is putting out here, and normally you do this right on the skin. And so you do it like this. Okay? But I wanted to show you the, the difference there of what that's like. So you can keep it moving around, you can go slower, you can go faster. And I feel warmth from this. So this is... Uh, it's a, it's a hot laser. I just cannot leave it in one spot like my other lasers. My other lasers are technically cold lasers. Even though they don't make anything cold, they um, do not produce any heat. So that's, what, that's what's nice. So anyway, so I can stop that and you'll see it just goes back to that regular red light again. Okay, so what's the difference? So the, this laser here has, a, has, has, like I say, has this red, red light and then it has three infrared frequencies in it. So when it's on, there's actually four frequencies. Now the thing most people don't realize is that with, when it comes to these cameras, like my cell phone here, they can detect infrared light. And you can always, you can always take your phone and uh, just as you're in the car, go down the street and you'll see which houses have security systems in them. And uh, because of the lighting that is uh, emitted by the cameras, so that they can see in the nighttime. The eyes don't see this. We feel it as warmth, but the infrared energy is there. And so the, our cameras will pick that up, just like you saw here. But when I'm looking at that, uh, I don't see any change in the light at all because it's infrared energy. Now, one of the things I discovered that I just want to uh, make everyone aware of, now this is where the right and left is going to come into a problem. It's because it's, it's really goofy here. But what I want to explain is that there are muscles that run up and down along the spine and they, are, they go all the way down to the sacrum, all the way up here into the neck. And they are generically called our erector spinae muscles. And there's actually three rows of these, spinalis, um, intercost um, lungismus, and intercostalis. So there's three different ones. You can look these up, like I say, generically, that are called the erector spinae muscles. And what I have found is that this area of the body is really crucial to work. And it is usually missed. And it's usually missed for a few reasons. One is that if a person is face down on a table, you don't feel this as nicely, the hardness that's in here. And so what I do is I always put people in a, an, an interesting position. I have them sit. And then I basically, I'll actually show you on me. I have them, if I'm going to do this side here, which here's the camera, it looks like it's the left side, but it's actually my right side. But basically, you do this. And the shoulder comes forward, the head comes down, and I push my back out on that side. And what it does is it makes all those, uh, all this area here stretch, and it, you can then feel all the bad areas. So they're sitting on a table, I'm behind the person, I have them go down and then stretch this out so that this part is being pushed out, in a sense, towards me. Their arm is across them so that the, the shoulder blade comes around and so it opens up the muscles underneath here. And you can tell so much by working that. But the neat thing is, is that when you work that area and you loosen that up on someone, you uh, dramatically loosen up the muscles into the neck and into the low back. And so it's, uh, it's, it's if you, when you look up the muscles in a, um, you could just type in uh, netter, N-E-T-T-E-R, into Google, netter and then anatomy images, or uh, netter anatomy, and then probably just do spinal erector muscles. 
and you will get a good picture of these muscles that go up and down and they go from the neck all the way down to the low back and it's really crucial to get these and what you want to do is you want to hit the areas that that are the worst so people feel the stuff in their neck and in their upper back and then they feel it in their lower back but the stuff that's often missed in terms of loosening up with the lasers or with massage or anything is the stuff in the thoracics along the, the spinal column or, i'm sorry along the ribs uh, more laterally you know, off to the sides have to get it you have to get it and you can make big changes in 20 30 minutes on people uh, using this high power laser by getting those muscles it'll loosen the stuff up into the neck and into the low back so i just want to make a quick video showing that and anybody that has a laser whether it's an apex or an acony or whatever they can use this method in that position to get people in to work on them uh, but the problem is that position you cannot get into when you're laying down on a table you just can't do it so it's, it's important to understand that I'm working with people sitting down on a, um, a massage table, sideways, you know, on the side. So I have the tape table right here. And so they're sitting, sit here and they're sitting here and they're facing, facing that direction. And so it gives them the ability to get into that stretch position that I was saying and open that area up back there. And then you can really feel. And what will happen is there'll be a lot of areas back there that literally feel like bone, they're so hard. And it's actually really hard, tight muscle and you can soften all that up and lots of problems go away. So I wanted to uh, introduce you to the new laser. I say the, the laser is this top piece here, this bottom part is just to stand, but the laser's here. And if anybody's interested in finding people with these lasers, with the Aspen, Aspen lasers at least, uh, you can go to, it's aspenlaser.com, A-S-P-E-N-L-A-S-E-R.com and you can find providers. And so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and have a great day, thanks.